streaming live with the Destiny House Christian Center of Freeport, New York. Although we are in the middle of a worldwide pandemic, it does not mean that you cannot connect with us. We invite you to visit our website at www.dhcc.church and follow us on all our social media platforms, Facebook and Instagram at Destiny House Christian Center. Also on Twitter and YouTube at Destiny House CC. Please pay attention to this week's announcements. Beloved, the sanctuary at DHCC is officially open for our worship services, and we invite you to worship with us in person if you are in the Freeport area. Visit us at 70 North Main Street in Freeport, New York every Sunday at 9 a.m. Please note, we will be adhering to the current guidance from the CDC regarding all COVID-19 protocols. We will be live streaming on Facebook Live every Sunday morning at 9 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. You do not need a Facebook page to view our live stream. Simply type in and click our Facebook link at www.facebook.com forward slash Destiny House Christian Center to view us. Otherwise, you may catch us on our YouTube channel on Sundays at 12 noon Eastern Standard Time. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel at www.youtube.com forward slash Destiny House CC. Please like, share, and follow us. The theme of the month at DHCC is Replenish as contextualized in Joel chapter 2, verse 25, which reads, And I will restore to you the years that the locust hath eaten, the cankerworm, and the caterpillar, and the palmer worm, my great army which I sent among you. 
Word Up Inspirations will broadcast on Wednesday morning at 7 a.m., offering a moment of inspiration to get your day started right. Do you need prayer? Contact our pastoral care team by sending your request to prayer at dhcc.church or submit your prayer request on our website at www.dhcc.church. Please be sure to check out our October newsletter entitled Destiny Speaks on our website at www.dhcc.church. DHCC invites you to join us every Wednesday evening at 7.30 p.m. for our Wednesday night worship, one hour of power prayer service. You are all invited to join us in worship, prayer, and praise. Don't miss your opportunity to experience and enjoy the presence of God. All are welcome. Proverbs 27 and 17 reads, As iron sharpens iron, so one person sharpens another. Please join the Men of Destiny for our monthly session of Keeping It Real, where seasoned men of God help the brotherhood become priests, husbands, fathers, leaders, and kingdom servants as God intended every first Monday of the month at 7.30 p.m. Real Men Talk with M.O.D. DHCC's Women of Destiny invites all women to their monthly virtual meeting every first Tuesday of the month at 7 p.m. For further details, please email wod at dhcc.church. Happy birthday to DHCC's own Brother Jason Smith Jr., Elder Francis Dent, Lady Jewel Jones Freeman, Lady Venus Sharp, Mother Faye Chambers, Master Ellis Smith, and to all those celebrating their birthday during the month of October, happy birthday to each and every one of you. Happy anniversary to all those celebrating their wedding anniversary during the month of October. Happy anniversary to you and many, many more. October is National Clergy Appreciation Month. The second Sunday of October is National Pastor Appreciation Day. This month, founded in 1992, has been set aside to acknowledge, recognize, and celebrate the contributions and service of senior pastors, clergy members, and ministry leaders. We take this time to give a Holy Ghost shout out to our very own senior pastor, Apostle Dr. Pepper Martin, for all her service, sewing, and sacrifice in leading the Destiny House Christian Center. May God continually bless you and give you the multiplied tenacity and grace to lead us into the fullness of our Christ-centered destiny and purpose. We are grateful for you, appreciate you, and we love you. Remember, all lives will matter when black lives matter. 2 Corinthians 9 verse 7 reads, Each of you should give what you have decided in your heart to give, not reluctantly or under compulsion, for God loves a cheerful giver. Here are the ways to worship the Lord in your giving. Thank you for your gift in this fertile ground. Thank you for your attention regarding our announcements. Now, let us prepare for worship. Grace, mercy, and peace be to each and every one of you. From God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ, thank you for tuning in with us in another broadcast at the Destiny House Christian Center where we will get you where you need to go, riding on the Word of God. We're celebrating Jesus. We are thankful. We are grateful. And we are appreciative of God this morning. This is the day that the Lord has made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. It is the fool that said in his heart that there is no God. But I'm grateful today.
that I know who Jesus is. The Bible lets me know that God is a spirit and they that worship him must worship him in spirit and in truth. Join us. Thank you for those of you who have joined us on Facebook and on YouTube and on Twitter. Thank you, social media. We appreciate you. We do not want to not acknowledge you. We want you to celebrate with us. Please share us on all your, on your personal pages. Let everyone have opportunity to worship the Lord today. We're grateful for the entrance of our apostle, Dr. Pepper Martin. We are appreciative of God for allowing her to be in her own pulpit today. And we're celebrating Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. We're going to go into our congregational hymn. We're going to go and we're going to sing today, No, Not One. There's not a friend, beloved, like Jesus. I've had people who said they're best friends forever and they walked out. But I'm grateful to the Lord that he is my greatest friend. He's such a friend that he laid down his life for me. How about you today? So I want you to sing with us as we sing this song. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. There's not a friend like the lowly Jesus. No, not one. No, not one. None else could heal all our souls' diseases. No, not one. No, not one. Jesus knows all about our struggles.
If I'm in heaven, he's there. God forbid if I make my bed in hell, the Bible says he's there also. There is no other friend. I'm grateful today. There ain't no other friend like Jesus. I dare you to type in the comment section, I have a friend, his name is Jesus. Lady Tracy, my friend is Jesus. Apostle, I'm grateful for the name of a friend named Jesus. He keeps me in my right mind. He keeps me with the activities of my limbs. I'm grateful. Hallelujah, hallelujah. I'm going to take you to Psalm 40, verse 1, and then we're going to go into prayer before we bring up the psalmist of the hour. And directly following the psalmist, we will have our apostle, the angel of this, of this house, Apostle Dr. Pepper Martin. Psalm 40, starting at verse 1, it reads, I waited patiently for the Lord. And he inclined unto me and heard my cry. He brought me up also out of a horrible pit, out of the miry clay. And he set my feet upon a rock and established my goings. And he hath put a new song in my mouth, even praise unto our God. Many, beloved, shall see it and fear and shall trust in the Lord. Let us pray. Dear Heavenly Father, we say good morning to you. We say thank you, Father. Good morning and thank you for being with us. Thank you for touching us today. We appreciate you, oh God. We bless you and we honor you with the fruit of our lips. Lord God, we thank you for another opportunity to come into your house. Lord God, we thank you that you let us know that when there are two or three gathered in your name, you promise that you'll be with us. And we thank you that you're here this morning. We thank you for those who thought it not robbery to come up into your house. We thank you, dear God, for those who sacrifice time to come into your household of worship. Lord God, we thank you for all of those who are on social media worshiping with us. We thank you for the angel in this house sitting at her, at, in her seat of authority that God has given her. We bless you and we praise you. We glorify you. We magnify you. You are our strength. You are our peace. You are our deliverer. You are our defender. We thank you for sitting with us right now. We thank you for your train filling the temple. We thank you for your spirit washing over us right now. We appreciate you, and God, we are thankful. We ask you, dear God, to move across this service. Move upon your people. Lord God, prophesy on the keyboard, the organ, and the drum. We thank you, dear God, for everyone in their assigned places. We lift up the angel of this house, none other than our own apostle, Dr. Pepper Martin. We thank you for the word that will come forth with precision accuracy. We thank you for added grace to her, added strength, clarity of thought and mind. Thank you, dear God, for the sword of the Lord in her hand through the preached word. And we thank you for what you will do further in this service. And we thank you. Clap your hands all over this building. Come on, let's put a praise on it. Come on, let's lift up those hands in this place. Let's worship the Lord in on today. Let's magnify the Lord on today. Our God is great. He's wonderful. He's beautiful. He's magnificent. And we give you glory, honor, and praise. Hallelujah. 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 Come on, let's lift up those hands all over this place. Hallelujah. 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 There is a sweet anointing in the sanctuary. There is a stillness in the atmosphere. So come lay down 
the burdens you have carried for in the sanctuary God is here there is a sweet I Lord, 
His name is Jesus. His name is Jesus. Yes. His name is Jesus. Yes, Lord. His name is Jesus. His name is Jesus. Precious Lord. Come on, let's usher in the presence of the Lord. Tell the Lord that you love him. Tell the Lord that you love him. Come on, speak to the Lord. Tell the Lord that he's awesome. Tell the Lord that he's excellent. Tell the Lord that he's mighty. Tell the Lord that, Lord, I thank you for everything that you've done for me. Lord, I thank you for, for setting me free. Lord, I thank you for giving me a clear mind. Hallelujah. worship you Jesus glory to your name we thank you father hallelujah we bless your holy name Lord Jesus we worship you God we worship hallelujah Jesus hallelujah Jesus oh God hallelujah Jesus yes Lord we worship the Lord. We worship the Lord. We worship the Lord. We worship. We worship. We worship the Lord. We worship the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We glorify you, Jesus. Hallelujah. We bless your name, God. Hallelujah. God is here. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. And we worship you. Yes, God. Have thine own way, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. We glorify your name. We magnify your name. We extol your name, Lord Jesus. We exalt you, O oh God. We worship you for your kindness. We worship you in the splendor of your power. We give your name glory, Jesus. 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 We give your name glory. We give your name, glory, Jesus. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Oh, God, we bless your name. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. We bless your name. We magnify your name. 
We extol your name. We give your name glory. We give your name glory, Jesus. We give you glory. Hallelujah. We give you glory. Hallelujah. We give you glory. Hallelujah, Jesus. We bless your holy name, oh God. We bless you in season. We bless you out of season. We bless you in the morning. We bless you in the noonday. We bless you in the nighttime. We bless you at midnight. We glorify your holy name. Thou art worthy to be praised, oh God. We enter into your presence. We thank you for taking us to the threshing floor. We thank you, oh God. Our praise is pure. Our praise is authentic. We thank you for receiving it. We thank you for mixing it with incense. We thank you that it's going up in before your nostrils as a sweet smelling savor. We give your name glory from on high in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Receive our praise, oh God. Receive our worship, oh God. Receive our cries, oh God. Receive our tears, oh God. Heal today, Jesus. Heal the hearts of your people. Heal the cries of your people. God, we call you. Oh God, we magnify you. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. In the virtual church, give him praise. Hallelujah. 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 We lift up those that don't know you, but in this moment, this is the moment for the saints. This is a moment right here. I need those of you who know God to jump in the water right here. Whether you're here physically, whether you're watching on Facebook, whether you're on Twitter, whether you're on YouTube, whatever your platform, open up your mouth. Lift up your head, all ye gates, and be lifted up the everlasting doors. Oh, God. Oh, God. Hallelujah. Just let it out. Hallelujah. Let your praise be a stress reliever. Hallelujah. Let them strengthen you for the next course of your life. We'll praise you until we get guidance. We'll worship you until we get heavenly advice. Father, we don't always know what to do next, but you know. And so we'll trust you. Hallelujah. As we relearn our praise. We're in an innovative season of worship. Hallelujah. We can't do church as usual, but we can continue to worship you. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. We rely on nothing but our testimony this morning. Hallelujah, Jesus. We glorify you today. Hallelujah, Jesus. Thank you for being a keeper. Thank you for being a restorer. Thank you for being a healer. Thank you for being a mind regulator. You kept us from destroying ourselves. Hallelujah. You kept our reputations. Hallelujah. You kept us through bad decisions. Glory to God. You've been good. And we give you glory. Hallelujah. You covered us, Jesus. Oh, oh, God, we bless you this morning. Thank you for being sovereign. Thank you for being sovereign. Somebody say thank you. Oh, God, for being sovereign. My God, I feel the power of the Holy Ghost. Open up your mouth right here. Woo! Oh, oh, God. Hallelujah. I feel.
feel them in my legs, my God. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you for strength and power. I come to tell you, thank you. If nobody else prays you, I owe you a praise. Hallelujah. I said, I owe you my worship. I recognize that you kept me. I recognize that your blood covered me. Hallelujah. I recognize that you sent your angels and gave them charge over me. God, I want to thank you. Yay. I came in here wanting to praise you. We give you glory. We give you honor. We give the Lord glory. Say yes. 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 Oh. Give him a yes. Give him a yes this morning. Give him a yes. Give him a yes. Give him a yes. Hallelujah. Oh, God, we thank you. Ah, thank you for being a friend. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Father. We bless you. Get your Bible and turn with me to Deuteronomy, the 28th chapter. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Good morning, virtual church. Good morning, physical church. Good morning, saints and friends. Hallelujah. If you're joining us for the first time, hallelujah. I'm going to ask that you share us on your pages. Hallelujah. And go to YouTube right now and subscribe to the Destiny House Christian Center page. Amen. If you have not subscribed to our YouTube channel, hallelujah, I'm going to ask everyone to make it a point today to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Amen. Glory to God. And get your Bible and turn with me to Deuteronomy, the 28th chapter. We will be reading one verse. Somebody say one verse. <laughs> Glory to God. If you can, Elder Dent, put it in the live chat for me. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Deuteronomy 28 and 8. Somebody put it up on YouTube and Twitter so that we can read the gospel, the word of God together. Deuteronomy 28, verse 8. Amen. I'm reading from the King James Version. The Lord shall command the blessing upon thee in thy storehouses. <laughs> and in all that thou settest thine hand to do. Thank you, Lord. Let me start over. The Lord shall command the blessing upon thee in thy storehouses and in all that thou settest thine hand unto. And he shall bless thee in the land which the Lord thy God giveth thee. Hallelujah. Those of you who know God, give it a praise right there. Agree with the word. Hallelujah. I know if God had commanded a blessing upon me and my storehouse, my praise would be a lot stronger than what I'm hearing. Hallelujah. He responds to a sound. Hallelujah. The Lord shall command the blessing. Not me, not the apostle, not the prophet, not Pastor Sid, not your own bishop. The Lord said, the Lord shall command the blessing upon thee. Y'all need to does anybody need God to render you a blessing in your storehouse? You ought to act like you need God. You ought to act like you appreciate it. This is what the Bible said. The Lord shall. And let me tell you something. He spoke to me earlier this week and said, declare the word unto the people. He shall. That means it's guaranteed, Christian. 
And guess what? When you command something, it has to obey. He's not asking the blessing. The word said he shall command. Lord, have the blessing has to obey. And guess what? Uh, upon thee, that means you, in. We're in the storehouse today. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Hallelujah. There's a physical storehouse and a virtual storehouse. If you're in the storehouse, the Lord said to tell his people, he shall command my God to bless us. Oh, God. Y'all need to walk in the south. Oh, yeah, my, my, my. That's why you can't miss church. Woo God. You can't miss it. Oh, Jesus. Woo God. And it don't stop there. And in all that thou settest thine hand unto. Lord, have mercy. And he shall bless thee in the land which the Lord thy God giveth thee. And the subject on this morning, the Lord said to tell you he's going to make it worth your while. <laughs> I feel like shouting and screaming. I'm telling you, God spoke to me. <laughs> and said to tell somebody that's about to throw in the towel, that's wondering where he is, that's doubting if he's going to show up, the Lord spoke to Apostle Martin and said to release this. God said he's going to make it worth your wow. <laughs> but there is a stipulation, he said. If you praise him. I, I, I keep pushing the praise not to stimulate emotion. No, no. We passed that. <laughs> that there, there's a spiritual need to do warfare in this last quarter of the year. Hallelujah. Glory to God. And if we have to have practice sessions, we're going to practice. Hallelujah. Because in this season, you cannot do things like you uh, used to do it. You can't be comfortable and get a storehouse blessing. You can't be usual and, and, and be a part of of the commanded blessing. Hallelujah. You got to shift your mind. You got to shift your comfort zone. You got to shift your comfort level. You got to shift your praise. Last week he spoke to me and said, it's time for the saints to relearn their praise. I don't know what you're waiting for. I'm speaking solely what God told me to say today. My title is apostle, but I feel the oil of a prophet. I can't explain it. God said he's going to make it, but it's to the praises. In other words, there's a sound that God is looking and his ear is to the earth. Y'all better hear me today. He showed me an ear, hallelujah, to the earth. And it is our responsibility, glory to God, to get in the vein of God. The Lord said in this season, use your voice as a weapon. Hallelujah. To many people of color, most of us don't have a huge inheritance. Most of us don't have hundreds of thousands of dollars or millions of dollars at our disposal. Bless God, some of us have uh, amassed that level of increase. But many of us have not. 
And the Lord said that regardless of what your socioeconomic status is, <laughs> glory to God, hallelujah. Stop looking at your bank account. Stop looking at even those who are wealthy. The Lord said to speak to the wealthy, the middle class, and the impoverished. That this kind of blessing can't be bought. Oh God. So it's not about your investments on today. Everybody who gives him a praise. Everybody who praises him anyhow. Everybody who has a deliberate form of worship. Hallelujah. You being selected as heaven's candidate to be a light in a dark world. And if you're going to be lit up in darkness, you got to be secured, hallelujah, by the most high. In other words, there's a promise that came from the promise keeper. He's going to keep you sustained in this season of famine. I hear you, God. God said to his praises, your praise is going to be converted. Lord, have mercy. At the exchange, oh my God. What is the exchange? When you leave the country, hallelujah, and you go to another country, you need the currency of that country in order to be sustained. And you got to go to, Brother Tim, the currency exchange booth. <laughs> and there is a representative there to tell you, hallelujah, how much your money is worth in that country's money. And whether you are, hallelujah, from Japan with the yen, from Europe with the Euro dollar, from the United States with the American dollar. In that moment, you need the currency of that country. Regardless of how low it is, <laughs> it's rating. Glory to God. And God said, oh God, to declare to his people, to, to speak it. But when I speak it, y'all got to agree with a praise. Hallelujah. Your praise today is currency. And when you set it up, <laughs> you're going to cause yourself to transition as a child of the kingdom. You will physically still be at the place of your position. But in the spirit, your praise is going to transition you, Lord have mercy, to the place that God is allowing you to travel, to the place of destiny. Hallelujah. And when you get there, the old currency is not going to have value. When you get there, your old praise is not going to have value. When you get there, the methods that you used to use to get the things that you de desired is not going to help you. God said there's a representative in the form of an angelic host that's waiting to receive your praise currency. And when it's pure, my God, when it's authentic, when you can send it up in life and still praise Him, when you can send it up when you have security, and still praise him. In other words, when you can do like Paul, to learn to whatever state you are found in, to therewith be content, to praise the name of our God in season, to praise him out of season. In other words, to exemplify, I will bless the Lord at all times and his praise shall continually be in my mouth for those that are part of that kind of praise 
What is it called? After that, it's called kingdom worship. Yeah. Hallelujah. And I need kingdom worshipers. I need kingdom worshipers on today to worship the Lord like it's going out of style. Because he said, everybody who does it will cause a release of your own angelic host to now convert your praise from an earthly realm into a heavenly realm and begin to purchase the things that you're going to need for your next level, for your next destination. Hallelujah. And guess what? I got an angel. You got an angel. You got an angel. You got an angel. He has given us his angels and commanded them to have charge over us. Hallelujah. I said hallelujah. And when you do it, regardless of what you're experiencing, when you do it, regardless of where you are, when you do it, so despite what it looked like, despite what you encountered, despite your experience, God said, for every tear you cried, for every negative circumstance you experienced, the Lord is going to make it. Help me preach this morning. It's going to make it. I said he's going to make it. He's going to make it. Keep praising him. The devil is still a liar. Keep worshiping him. The devil is still the father of all lies. Greater is he that is in me than he that's in the world. I've got a right to give him praise and my praise payment. Hallelujah. When I take it with me, wherever my end is, it's going to work for my good. Everything I put my hand to, he's got a commanded, a commanded blessing. When I come to the storehouse, I walk in blessed. I come out with more blessings. Bring ye all the tithes and offering to the storehouse so that he can rebuke the devourer. Say yes, he promised to make me a lender, my God, and not a bird. So in the, the power of the Most High, the Most High God, I prophesy to my wallet. I prophesy to the membership. I prophesy to my resources. Everything with my name on it. Let the angels bring it. Come on here. We will praise you until the demons that tied me up, blocked me up, gotta go. Let the blood be a holy ghost plunger and unclog my pipes. God, I position myself to receive the increase. Somebody say overflow. You promised to make it worth my while. So while I'm waiting, I'm going to praise her. While I'm waiting, I'm going to say thank you. While I'm waiting, I'm going to pray. I'm going to sing. I'm going to rejoice. And I'm going to trust him. Even when I can't trace him. Because the word said, Lo, I'm with thee always. Even until the end of this world. Yeah. The earth is the Lord's and the fullness thereof, the world and they that dwell therein say yes, yeah, and the last shall be first. 
somebody say, God, switch the position in the name of Jesus and bring down every high place, everything that exalted itself against the knowledge of God. I command that let God arise and every enemy be scattered. Take three minutes to open up your mouth. Come on. Exactly three minutes. Get on your face if you need to. He said he's going to make it worth your while. This is for people that don't mind getting ugly. This is for people that don't mind, hallelujah, breaking a sweat. This is for people that don't mind losing a lash. This is for people that may need to lose some of their weave. This is for people, hallelujah, that may have to sweat out their perm. This is for people that understand the move of God. This is for people, come on, two more minutes. Come on here, hallelujah. You can't sit and stay, hallelujah. Say yes, I need to hear a sound in here. Hallelujah, I didn't come to be a cheerleader. I came to lead God's people in the praise that's going to change the trajectory of your life. I'm telling you what God's showing me. God said give him a spectacular form of worship. And when you do it, he's going. He's going to make the blessing that's about to be released worth. Oh, hallelujah. Act like you believe it. Get in the flow. Hallelujah. Oh, God. One more minute. Hallelujah, Jesus. Oh, 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 Lord. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That's it, Christian. That's it right there. That's it right there. That's it, son. Let a man need a new satire. Robo satire. He can a man need a new satire. Yes, God. Yes, God. Oh, 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 God. We give you glory. Open up your mouth. That's it, Toya. Worship the Lord. Hallelujah. This kind of worship is not for punks. It's not for the fainting heart. Hallelujah. God said jump in. Jump into a spectacular move. Jump in. Yay. Oh. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. On the virtual church. Give him glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Yes, sir. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Now let's seal it in worship. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We worship you, Jesus. And we agree with you, God. We thank you for fresh oil. We thank you for the release of a yes. Hallelujah. We thank you for what you are doing in the spirit. This is a test of faith. But we already saw what the other side looks like. Hallelujah. Help us to hold on and endure in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. He's going to make it. <laughs> He's going to make it worth your while. Why? Because the devil can't get victory. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. I wish you would just go in, go in, go in. He's going to make it worth your while. 
It's a little crazy right now. <laughs> but the Lord we serve specializes in the cray-cray. <laughs> Hallelujah. I said God specializes in the cray-cray. Thank you, Father. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, yes, Lord. Oh, God. Thank you, Father. We worship you, God. There's an exchange going on right now as you praise him. Oh, give it to him. And he will give it back unto you. Good measure. Press down. Shaking together and running over. Will men give unto your bosom? Hallelujah. The Lord said he's going to make it worth your while. We're going to continue to worship the Lord right here. We are not lifting an offering. We are worshiping the Lord in our giving. And this is the time to give. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. While the waters are troubled, those of you who are tithers, this is a good day and a good time to bring your 10%, hallelujah, to the storehouse. Hallelujah. Glory to God. You can just look at, hallelujah, thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father. Look right on your screen and the various methods for electronic giving is on the screen. Hallelujah. Cash app, use cash tag or dollar sign, Destiny HCC, Zelle, hallelujah, or PayPal. You can use two email addresses for your convenience, either donation at dhcc.church or Destiny House Christian Center at Gmail. Dot com. You can download the app Givelify and put in the name of our church, Destiny House Christian Center. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Or you can do it the old-fashioned way and make a check payable to DHCC Incorporated and mail it to DHCC Inc. Post Office Box 139 Amityville, New York 11701. Hallelujah. And for those of you who want to come and give in a traditional manner, if you are in the physical church, you can come at this time. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to God. I'm going to ask everyone on our virtual church, amen, if you would take this time to sow with us. Hallelujah. This is good ground. Hallelujah. This is good ground. We don't pay God, and you certainly don't pay me, but we do use his funds for his use. Hallelujah. And listen, those of you questioning where to send your tithes, if you do not have a church home, you can tithe in this ministry. When you tithe, it is an example, a symbol of a sacrifice. Hallelujah. The first fruit of your increase, when you give him the 10, God will get in the 90. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. And we thank you, Father. God bless you, Brother Stephen. God bless you, Lady Detrice Kennedy. Hallelujah. We are worshiping the Lord in giving on YouTube, Twitter, and Facebook. Hallelujah. Don't eat and walk out the restaurant. If you've been blessed by this ministry, sow a seed of thanksgiving. If you belong to a church, tithe into your own ministry. Hallelujah. But bless this house with an offering to tell God thank you for the commanded blessing that you received on this morning. Amen. Let us agree in prayer. Father, we thank you for the opportunity to give. And we know, hallelujah, we are sowing into good ground. Now, God, we continue 
to give you praise, glory, honor, and worship as you stretch the funds, as you let the spirit of increase get into the funding that we would be empowered and sustained, hallelujah, to undergird that which you've called us to do in the spirit of excellence with the applied ethical behavior to be good stewards and good servants, which includes watching over your money. Thank you for choosing us and your people. And we give your name glory, honor, and praise in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. God bless you. If you are interested in learning more about this ministry, you can pull us up, hallelujah, our website, dhcc.church. And listen, if you want to be a member, simply send us an email to info at dhcc.church and put in the subject line, hey, I want to be a member. And someone from our membership management team will certainly get back to you. We want to give you just a few announcements before we leave you on the virtual house um, on today. We want to bring to your attention that on Sunday, November 14th, here in this sanctuary, we will be having a renowned attorney um, come and to uh, present a workshop on elder care. If you are a caretaker or if you are in need of these services, make your way to 70 North Main Street, Freeport, New York, and we are going to receive the services of Carmel Robilliard. She is a woman of God, but she is a New York attorney, an expert in her field, in the field of elder care. If you have questions about what to do with your aging parents' assets, how do you qualify for Medicaid eligibility? What is a power of attorney? What is the difference between a power of attorney and a will? And what, which one is the most pertinent item of paperwork that I need? Is my power of attorney worth the paper it's on? These are the kinds of questions that she will be addressing, and it's going to take place from 12 to 2. She will be presenting from 12 to 1, and then allow the remaining hour for questions from the audience. There will be a physical audience as well as a virtual audience. So if you can't join us physically, we will welcome you online, amen? And then on November 28th, we are going to see the play. I forgot the name of the play. That's what it is. <laughs> that play that y'all should have heard, I prayed because I don't have it. Amen. We're going to see a Broadway play, and we only have a few tickets left. And because of the favor of Pastor Sidney Martin, we got group rate tickets for simply $49. Amen. It's not off Broadway. It's on Broadway. So the tickets have gone rather quickly. I'm going to ask that if you want to join us, you are welcome. Simply send your payment to Cash App dollar sign destiny hcc or any of the additional platforms and we will welcome you at that play there will be a follow-up conversation between the men of destiny and the women of destiny to discuss what we gathered from that particular performance amen so we're looking forward to that amen god bless your heart we are so grateful for being here at the last day of the month of october with so many themes, but we are transitioning into November. Amen. And with each month, we are going into it with a deliberate mindset of expectation. Those of you in the virtual church, God bless you. Enjoy the rest of your day and may heaven smile upon you. I am Apostle Dr. Pepper Martin and this is the Destiny House Christian Center where we will get you where you need to go. God bless you, Facebook. God bless you, YouTube. And God bless you, Twitter. Come on and praise him here in the physical church. Hallelujah. Those of you who know God, hallelujah. Hallelujah. We are going to pray, hallelujah, before we leave. 
Hallelujah. What every 